at two projects who have been talked about for years and years and years and have seen little action until this week, the new International Trade Crossing and the M1 Rail Project. First up, a new crossing to Canada. The governor announced this week members of the Windsor Detroit Bridge Authority. They're the ones overseeing this new crossing, which is expected to be completed in 2020. And even though the U.S. hasn't coughed up the uh, 250 mil for the U.S. Customs Plaza yet, both Canadian Michigan authorities say, yes, this project is on. Gentlemen, yes, it is on, right? It is on. Yeah. <laughs> Matty it's Maroon on. can fight uh, to the death over this, but, uh, but I mean, you're going to build a bridge. You're not going to stop. It, 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 think about that. If you can stop the government from building a bridge, uh, which is, you know, the, the most basic responsibility of government, infrastructure, uh, how, how silly would that, would that be? So uh, we're going to get the crossing. It, you know, there may be some other hurdles that we got to clear before, you know, I can drive across it. Um, but, but this is going to happen. We're going to get the bridge. I don't know if we're going to get it on a timetable that, uh, you know, we, we would like to see. I mean, Uncle Sugar still got to come up with that quarter billion dollars and the highway trust fund is now empty. So there's a lot of projects stacking up all over the country mm -hmm. that can't be funded because the highway trust fund has no money in it. But you know, I think this is That's a, positive a big step. problem, yeah. the highway trust fund. It's a big issue. problem for a lot of projects, but particularly for this bridge and you know, Michigan roads in general, you think, well, they couldn't get any worse. They might. All right, and we just want to say a big congratulations to the M1 Rail Project that finally they started construction this week on Woodward. <laughs> three miles of that rail is going to go into downtown. It's been 10 years in the making of finally getting there. It so really uh, hopefully we see that soon.